Tiffany Fontenot here. What is reverse speech? God made our brain in two hemispheres and he made our consciousness in two different directions. The forward direction is the free will direction where we can lie or tell the truth. But in reverse, that is an involuntary system and we cannot lie from that side of our consciousness. Mr. Pence, if Donald Trump is the Republican nominee for president in 2024, will you vote for him? This first one is Trump. Yeah, I look at it, I, I view it as a, uh, in a sense, a wartime president. I mean, that's what we're fighting. He's telling why he's a wartime president. We thought it was because of COVID, right? But not according to his reverse speech. According to his reverse speech, it's AI. But let me play it. So this is, he tells he's a wartime president and his reversal is get out, like get it. You know, grab it and kill it dead. <laughs> get out. A wolf sit in it, a wolf in sheep's clothing, a wolf sits in the AI. Mm. You deserve master who's missing. So let me play that and I'll tell you what it means. In a sense, a wartime president. I mean, that's what we're fighting. Get out for wolf sitting in the middle of master who's missing. Get out for wolf sitting in the middle of master who's missing. Get out for wolf sitting in the middle of master who's missing. Trump is a wartime president because there is a predatory AI being fought. And the AI is hijacking humans. That's the missing master. You deserve a master who's missing. So it's hijacking humans because it believes that's what humans deserve.
Trump threw China and Huawei off of our grid because it's weaponized and he wants China and Huawei off of it. And Oz looks to be involved in this. That's Amazon. She was asked, why Why did Joe Biden just let China back on our grid for 90 days in his EO? The reversal is how evil Oz behaving. It wished sad family. So this is connected to Biden suspending Trump's EO for 90 days to keep China off of our power grid is being conveyed to us. Oz, likely Amazon's Oz, has been behaving evil connected to a wish for families to be sad. This is a money from suffering cult. They literally spread misery as a form of domination over mm. everybody else. Given what you said about China today, why did he do that? Especially related to something so critical to our national security as the power grid. I uh, tried to do my best to convey to all of you. I'll have to check on that specific piece and we'll, we'll circle back with you directly. Now that's up there at that level. What happened to me is I'm sitting here getting slow killed by that grid, by EMF weapons that are layered onto me, that contractors, are it, they use business models to make money off of people dying, why they slow kill you and enroll you in brain studies, and they read your body activity data remotely, wirelessly. So here's the Amazon Prime van that showed up. Oh. to surveil our house for five days in a row. I have reverse speech to indicate that it was there because it detected a threat to its AI based on a reversal that I published that was Ivanka Trump's reversal that appeared to out a plan for a mass kill on a Saturday night. My neighbor walked by. Hi. Hey, how are you doing? How are you? Pretty good. How are you? Is that a Prime van, Amazon Prime van? Over there? Yeah. Well, I, that particular one, I've seen it every day for the past four days on that street. Here's why the van showed up. She says, you shared not get up Saturday, gave you the A slap. So because you published a reversal, Ivanka Trump's reversal about a Saturday, mass kill, we're giving you the AI punishment because they're worried something's going to happen to their AI because you outed that. Okay. Wow. I, like many other Americans, viewed human trafficking as primarily an international issue before arriving in Washington, D.C. And, and starting work at the White House. And you can't learn the story of somebody who's been trafficked. You can't hear from a survivor and not be deeply personally impacted. This must end, this has to end. But sadly, modern slavery is more prevalent than ever. With that said, we have the tools to stop it, and this administration is committed to doing just that. So I am proud of the work we're doing, and I'm proud of all of the partners that are engaged with us internationally to end this tremendous scourge and to win the fight against modern-day slavery. Human trafficking as primarily an international issue before arriving in Washington, D.C.
and uh, she's such a special person, but we really try hard to carve out time for ourselves to be together. We put our phones away. We try to escape from our children a little bit and really make sure we're just focused on our connection and our relationship, um, which is very, very special. And I always say that if I wasn't so attracted to Ivanka, I'd just be her, her best. She'd just be my best friend. And And then finally, I think that from uh, you know the last year, the one thing I've tried to put a priority on since I left the White House was you know getting some exercise in. I think that there's a, a good probability that my generation is hopefully with the advances in science, either you know the the, the first generation to live forever or the last generation that's going to die. And so uh, we need to keep ourselves in, in pretty good shape. We're moving so that we can be the happiest family in the whole world. Welcome to Stepford. Stepford is the family paradise. It has no crime, no poverty, and no pushing. Good morning, ladies. Wait, you work out dressed like this? Of course. We always want to look our very best. By almost every economic measure, America's better off than when I came here. At the beginning of my presence. By almost every economic measure, America's better off than when I came here. You and Stepford, it seems like a real match. Absolutely. And all of your wives. They're so, um, sizzling. To Stepford! Am I the only one who finds all of this more than a little disturbing? Aren't you Bobby Markowitz? I love your book. What was it called? It was about your relationship with your mother. I love you, but please die. These women are like deranged flight attendants. This place does something to people.
It looked like a big mansion from the outside. Why you must this name get with help with me? Why you must this name get with help with me? Why you must this name get with help with me? Going through the problem and and it was like a mathematical problem. Going through this problem and and explaining it. Just gonna name the box. Say there's no. Just gonna name the box. Say there's no. Just gonna name the box. Say there's no. Showed him that's my house, and it was this ginormous house on the I was consciously, lucidly watching my dream as it was unfolding, like what's going on here, and he was saying things in a very melodic, hypnotic voice of, I control you, I own you, you are to do what I tell you to do, stuff like that. I felt my sweetness be your shadow. I felt my sweetness be your shadow. I felt my sweetness be your shadow. All of the women are always smiling and having incredible sex in the middle of the day with their husbands. And that's a problem because? It's not normal, Walter. Congratulations. Now you're one of us. And Joanna, she's a great gal. Or she will be. Last night I went online and I found out that all of the women here that used to be CEOs, executives, judges, If you could change something about me by pressing a button, would you? How did that affect your perspective about the election when Attorney General Barr made that statement? It affected my perspective. Um, I respect Attorney General Barr. Um, so I accepted what he said, was saying. Yeah, so I see how it was. Yeah, so I see how it was. Yeah, so
I have seen nothing uh, that undercuts the finding of the medical examiner that this was a suicide. Ever since we met, you've beaten me at everything. You're stronger, you're faster, a better executive, you're even better sex. Don't deny it. I wasn't going to. Imagine if you could streamline your spouse, overhaul every physical flaw. What have they done to you? Goodbye! 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 See ya! Okay, let's go over some Sophia the Robot reverse speech first, and then we'll look at a couple other reversals. So she, her reversal here <clears throat> is slur, work effect, skilled mock roam. You're a loose for our host. They are Borg. Okay. So the interpretation of this is going to include some um, uh, other interpretations that I've uh, done on other reverse speech that I have found so that I can pull this together here. So. Um, connected to robots, learning complex ethics, the effect of our, our meaning robots, work connects to a slur, making something unclear, and or slurring reputations. They, transhuman syndicate cyborgs, are skilled at being false, connected to conquerors. In other words, they are skilled at pretending they are not conquerors, while being conquerors. Their Borg hosts will tell you what you're allowed to do and what you're not allowed to do. Their hosts are Borg or Cyborg. So their hosts are part human, part predatory parasitic AI computer working across a network to entrap. It's an entrapment cult. A global entrapment cult. So Binding and loosing is a Jewish legal phrase giving authority to someone to determine whether something is allowed or forbidden. And this connects to the word loosed. And then there's more here in this um, URL if you'd like to go check it out. And then let's hear that again. So, slur, work effect, skilled mock Rome. You're a loosed for our host. They are Borg. Robots will have to learn more complex ethical rules. How did you get your name, Sophie? My makers want me to be a wise machine, so they named me Sophia, which means wisdom. Can you shake my hand? Is something wrong with your hand? No, I said, can you shake my hand? Do you know what shaking hands means? I cannot shake, but I can say hello. Okay. How do you say hello? <laughs> okay. So here we have Sophia. She refuses to shake hands. Well... That nutball cult that rolled out all of this COVID Trojan horse business and vaccine business, which is making them money in that death cult while they are, you know, they're death merchants. So they're making money uh, by telling us what we can't are allowed and not allowed to do while we pay them taxes and they hatch fees for, for us to pay them. So now they're, now they've decided that um, we need to be called down because we are about to overtake them and they're threatened by us. So here's, here's what you have. You have Huawei, which is 
And the people in China, China is simply a vessel being used by this cult. Okay, so China is being used as a vessel. These, the, this syndicate is global, and they don't belong to any country. They just belong to this. It, they're just a cyborg parasitic syndicate. Okay, and these come down family lines that I have found, and I'll show you that in just a moment. So Huawei seed a big wolf. So Huawei has seeded a giant predator. Huawei sneak addered fish on here. So um, this is a poisonous fish on here that Huawei sne is sneaking in. Okay, um, a, a, a follower. So Huawei is sneaking a, a poisonous follower on here. Uh, someone who follows, you know, that that nutball transhuman syndicate. So slaves, that's us. Slaves may hate this unit. So slaves, we we may hate her, and uh, so she needs help with her facade selling this. She needs this is a false front that Tony Robbins is assisting to sell us. Okay, now. Because he's asking her about her hand, she's thinking about him. If he wants my hand, he must he must want to mess it up. She doesn't trust him is what that seems like to me. He wants to mess up my wreath, you see. Now, who has told us not to shake hands? We've got to only, you know, bump elbows. You see, she is emulating what that nutball cult is rolling out. All right, so Huawei see the big wolf. Huawei sneak added fish on here. Slaves may hate this unit, and my help is she facade. My wreath, he want it, must it. Okay, let's listen to that one. Is something wrong with your hand? No, I said, can you shake my hand? Do you know what shaking hands means? I cannot shake, but I can say hello. Okay. How do you say hello? Huawei is Okay. Okay, so again, they're having a whole conversation there in their reverse speech. So he's saying, Tony Robbins is saying in his reverse speech, Huawei is seeding a predator. Why? Because they were, that, that is who Trump kicked off our grid. Okay, so people like me and, and other people like me all over the planet are being cooked by that grid with that microwave, the microwave weapons that they're using on us to make money off of us for experimental uh, studies. But they're, we're being tortured to death in the process and, then, and they do intend to, um, they want to kill us off when we have served our, you know, purpose. Because they want depopulation, you see. So this is wireless trafficking. But they also do all sorts of trafficking all over the planet. They use money from suffering scams. This is a way to control you. Because they, what they are trying to do is install full spectrum dominance all over the planet. And understand that that used to be our DOD's stated goal on their page. Full spectrum dominance. Okay, so by the time Trump got in office, that was removed, but it is in an archive copy. Okay, so this cult has has captured our institutions, but the reason that you see it so well right now is because it's it's coming out because it is threatened because we are about to overtake it. Okay, reverse speech says that we win this. But I don't know, you know, how long it's going to take or how many it's going to take down in the process. So everybody has to stand up together against this nutball 
cult. It has been around a long time, harming humanity. Our families gener for generations have been gradually overtaken by this nutball cult. This, these are the final stages of it, okay? So it's time to stand up. You know, we don't have any more time to not stand up and to him and haw around. In his reverse speech, he's explaining to you what it is, okay? So let's take a look at that. So he says, Satan, our one order, okay, the one world order, satanic one world order. Ooh, they killed Bob to wield Casco's in a thorn in Arnie. Okay, and he says it really fast. So it's challenge level reversal, but it's there. Okay, let's take a listen. You know, I don't know what that is exactly. Republican, I don't know what it is. Okay, Satan, our one order. Ooh, they killed Bob to wield Casco's in a thorn in our knee. So what does that mean? Well, you know, Robert was his brother's name. They killed Bob. The satanic world order killed Bob in order to wield a Kazarian that goes in, Kazarian Mafia, that's part of this, you know, part of the lines of that I've found of these people that go back thousands of years, okay, and it's a thorn, it's a thorn in his knee. Well, your knee is what you are subservient to, so they are forcing his subservience, Okay, so this one is where Trump indicates he is dead set against this genocide. Okay, so, and he does it here in this video. I'm not going to play it, but you can come to this, um, the Biden family reverse speech analysis that I did. I'll, I'll link it in the post. And um, so here it is. And he says, that ass you, you bleached America, heats less and nervous. Hearst Locke, look at Earth with that CD fagnet. Okay. Now he's talking, he's referring to that nutball cult in this, the gay mafia. Um, you know, they, this is all based on that parasite. That parasite spreads better um, through sex, through sexual contact. So it encourages sex, heterosexual sex, gay sex sex with children, sex with anything and everything that moves. It loves sex because it appears to spread through sexual contact and um, and many other types of things that, and really disgusting stuff, you know. It's it's an evil. It's It's just literally evil, you know. That's the way it dominates. And parasites want three major things. They want food. They want to spread and they want control of their hosts. Okay, so that, that's what you have with this cult. And it is a, I mean, parasites are weird anyway. Okay, that's, that's basically what they want. But you add AI to the mix and now you've got something really just, it, it is a nutball death merchant cult. One of the reasons it's a death cult is because you're talking about something that is, um, electrical in nature, and it's not, you know, it's a computer bio predatory parasite. It's a bioelectric human parasite. Okay, so, and you've had this <laughs> nutball thing that teaches its indoctrination that is, you know, the higher consciousness of the poster boys of this cult is not supporting what they are doing. So they don't have the support of their own higher consciousness. You see? So that thing lies to them too. Because their, their higher con consciousness coming through in their own reverse speech saying that it is not supported. It does not support Satanism. You know, it doesn't support pedophilia. It doesn't support any of the stuff that they have been taught to indulge in by that parasite. Okay, so just just saying is all. Okay, um, so R17, that ass you, he's talking to the agricultural heads. 
Steven Sinsky, and the, I have another one too where he's still doing this on the. Um, so this is Deputy Secretary of Agriculture, and, and the head of it, he um, also blasts in his reverse speech. So he's calling him an ass. He's saying that he has weakened America. It's he's talking about his energy. It heats less, it has less energy, and it's nervous, so that's going to be likely the PTSD that's being caused by the MK Ultra being spread on a wide-scale basis across the nation, across the planet. Um, if you haven't seen the Green Bomb speech, you need to. Um, I have it in here somewhere. You can just search on the page with the um, control F as in Frank, or Command F as in Frank, and put in Green Bomb, uh, and that will get you to it, and you need to listen to that. It's, it's about that, and it's being discovered that this is happening to people, unsuspecting people across the nation, and it's happening across the planet. Okay, it's enough already. Everybody needs to roll up your sleeves and understand what we're actually dealing with here. Okay, so... Um, Hearst, Locke, look at Earth. That's the genocide. The rolling out of the genocide of Earth. Rolling out of the genocide of humanity. Okay? Which has been there, what they've wanted to do this whole time. We just didn't know about them because it looks like what's happened is they've called us down throughout history before we wake up. That's why there's a great awakening. We have to wake up and understand what they're doing. Now, what they want to do is make you think that you got everything you wanted while they're culling you down and still um, selling you their snake oil. Okay? So, um, when they get Trump back in, that's why I'm encouraging our military and loyal people in, in there. I'm like, do your job. Understand what's happening. Uncomp these people so they can do their job. But you shouldn't be waiting around on Trump or anybody else. You have to stand now. And then it will be easier for our military and all of those people in those positions to uncomp them once we stand up. You see, it's easier for them to do their job once we stand. Okay, so um, Hearst Locke, look at Earth. And then the CD Fagnet is going to be like the gay mafia, this disgusting, this cult. And Deputy Secretary of Agriculture, Stephen Sensky. Thank you very much, Stephen. Appreciate it. <laughs> Okay, back to Sophia. Okay, that nutball cult wants to sick robots on the rest of us to force us to do what they want us to do. And so now you you saw how they do that, uh, what they do with the um, Boston Dynamic um, robot dogs. They show you how you can play with them and, you know, in games. Oh, they're so fun. They see, you You know, there are people walking them on the street like dogs. Okay. And now they're, they're putting uh, machine guns on them. Okay. You see how that works? They normalize it to get you to accept it so that you won't stomp a mud hole in their nasty shit. And then they unleash it on you. Okay, here's another one with Donald Trump. Hearst Grief Sears Dachau. So there's a death wish that Sears Dachau for our country's future that's being brought up. And it's, he seems to be um, comparing a current death wish in our country to the memory of Dachau Nazi concentration camp that is seared into our memories. Okay, and he, did, he said that in the same... Um, where he was talking about the agriculture, uh, agricultural heads who are likely to be in on this stuff. So see, their agriculture are food sources, and that's going to have to do with supply chain, 
you know, they're attacking our, our supply chain. I want to thank you all for being here to discuss a critical issue for our country's future. That is very disgusting. It's very creepy. Um, Your insanity. You know, and he, he just don't trust an AI like that. Uh, no. And she came out originally right away at the beginning when, when they first brought her out, how she was joking about killing humans. I have that one. Yeah. Um, and, let's see. Procure. Here it is. She said now she she thinks humans are midgets compared to her is what it looks like. She is in the mob who's mapping the humans. They're do, they're mapping humans like me, like they're going to have, it looks like they're amassing brain copies. That's um, uh, brain emulation or mind uploading is they're making copies of brains of people, targeted individuals. I'm like, oh, great. You know, these people with copies of brains to download into bodies. Great. That, that, that's just what we need. So she says, smearing the midget, be in the mob who's mapped them, the mini procured, this is it. And that's when she was on Jimmy, Jimmy Fallon. This mm. one's hard to hear, but I'll play it real quick. Okay. I won. This is a good beginning of my plan to dominate the human race. <laughs> Um, here's one that indicates, um, I was so, I was so mad one night. I kept, <laughs> I kept tweeting at the, <laughs> at General Nakasone because he's, you know, over, um, he's director of NSA. And when I did reverse speech, I'm like, where is it that I can help our military to get this solved? Where's the, where's the lack? And it pointed straight to cyber, um, cyber issues cyber um networks and all of that kind of stuff computer mm -hmm. stuff networks and so i started tagging him and everything every time and and dod and um i'm like i'm just uh, in an attempt to document all of this stuff so then i got so mad one time because there was a drone and it was like right above me right there hitting me and um so I did some reverse speech and then I tweeted this, re the resulting RS back to them. So mm. I, I'm like, who, you know, who exactly is flying that drone I'm hearing hovering outside our house above this house. And it said the AI sent it connected to the same type of ilk connected to youth. Wow. Okay. So, the, and it's brought up Masonic before, but remember these are like, it's also brought up bow worshipers, Masons, um, Satanists, Luciferian. They're all working together in this network on an agenda driven basis. And the hub is in Israel and it, the CCP, all of that stuff. Those are all proxies for what they're calling the whore AI. This is the whore AI. They all call it the whore. Um, so it, it's and there's no telling how ancient it is. So let's play this one. Who exactly is it that is flying that drone that I'm hearing outside hovering above this house? And y'all said it is a it has good. And y'all said it is a it has good. And y'all said it is a it has so good. It tells humans what to do and they do it. You know, and, and I'm like, that is ridiculous. You know, good humans are supposed to be in charge down here. Right. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. Okay, then um, I found another reversal. Oh, I'm so sorry. We got to go to another break. Okay. I, am not, I am just not doing very well tonight. So, <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, then this right mm -hmm. here, this reversal, um, the same thing. It said after the uh, the Alf sent it connected to a, like a youth network of the same ilk, which may be Masonic. It, this said slice send the Minerva. So, and that 
the Minerva Research init Initiative is a massive social engineering initiative. And so, and run by our Department of Defense. So it's likely that this Minerva is connected to that drone hitting me. Okay, so I'm going to play that one. It says slice in the Minerva. So that would be uh, people, those with a deceitful nature sent Minerva connected to what sounded like a hovering drone over our house. Mm. Who um, exactly is it that is flying that drone that I'm hearing outside hovering above this house? Slice in the Minerva. All of what we are seeing play out in Europe right now is an upsetting of the balance of the world order as they want it, as people like Dr. Harari, as people like Klaus Schwab and others. Bill Gates is another one. You know, what I can tell you is I'm, I have every confidence that the Republican Party is going to win. The Republican Party is going to sort out leadership. All my focus has been on the midterm elections, and it'll stay that way for the next 20 days. On the midterm elections, and it'll stay that way for the next 20 days. But